Welcome back to another video. I'm going to share with you in this video the top workouts that slow aging on a cellular level. Because new research has found that on top of all the other health benefits you already know about exercise, it can also help with aging too. But not all exercises are equal. If you like this video, please click the like button. Please leave your comments below and share this video. Please also hit the notification bell so you won't miss any of my future weekly video release. Please also subscribe to this channel. According to a new study in the European Heart Journal, when it comes down to the anti-aging effect of exercises, endurance exercises and high-intensity interval training, both slowed signs of aging when compared to lifting weights, at least on the cellular level. These exercises keep your heart rate up and can keep your cells younger for longer. The researchers determined this by measuring the structures at the end of chromosomes, known as telomeres. Telomeres are made of repetitive sequences of non-coding DNA that protect the chromosome from damage. Each time a cell divides, the telomeres become shorter. Eventually, the telomeres become so short that the cell can no longer divide. Now, here's how the study went down. A team of German researchers divide 124 healthy but inactive adults between the age of 30 to 60 into four groups. One group carried on with a non-existent exercise routine. The other three sweated it out for 45-minute session three times a week for 26 weeks. The endurance training group walked or ran continuously. The HIIT group completed a warm-up, four rounds of alternating between faster and slower running and a cool down. The resistance training group used eight different strength training machines to complete a circuit of exercises including seated chest presses, lat pull downs and leg presses. At the end of the study, people in both the endurance training group and the HIIT group had experienced anti-aging effects of the workout, while the inactive and resistance training group did not. The anti-aging effects were measured at the cellular level by examining white blood cells from the blood taken before the start of the study and days after the final exercise session. Researchers noted two important changes in the cells of the two endurance training groups. The telomeres, the cap at the end of the chromosomes, lengthened, and telomerase, an enzyme involved in maintaining those caps, increased. These effects are both important for cellular aging, regenerative capacity, and thus healthy aging. Telomeres naturally shrink over time, and as they do, cells die instead of continuing to divide. Cell death is bad news not just for wrinkles and grey hair, but for risks of age-related health concerns like heart disease, cognitive decline, and even early death. So, what was it about endurance and HIIT workouts that could stuff off that shrinkage? The researchers hypothesized that those type of exercise affected the level of nitric oxide in the blood. Since nitric oxide increases blood flow and lowers blood pressure, it could in turn have affected the cell changes found in those two groups of participants. Although the study didn't find anti-aging benefits from resistance training, it doesn't mean that there is no benefit to weightlifting. As you get older, your body will have decreased muscle mass. This can increase your risk for falls, fracture, impaired function, osteoporosis and death. If anything, treat this study as a reminder to maintain a balanced approach to exercise. Try a mix of aerobic and resistant training. Almost any workouts can become HIIT workouts simply by creating intervals of intensity. HIIT involves short period of intense exercise followed by recovery or easier period. Seven minutes of HIIT workouts are common, although you should perform the exercise according to your body's need and capabilities. Please take a look at my previous video on the science of HIIT. Here is a sample anti-aging 7-minute HIIT workout routine for you to follow along. 7 30 seconds exercises with 30 seconds rest in between.
Thank you for watching until the end. If you like this video, please click the like button. Please subscribe, share and comment. Please also hit the bell so that you will be notified of any new future video release. If you're interested in improving your health and fitness, and if you want to prevent lower back pain, please take a look at my book, which is now available from Amazon. Thank you.